by any definition, Abudi Abu Jaoud is a film nut. By day, he's a book publisher, but in his spare time, he's created an archive of Arab cinema. He's been collecting film posters for more than 40 years, and he can tell you about every film ever made in Lebanon. Abir Ahmar visited his treasure trove in Beirut. In the basement of a publishing house in Beirut, a small room preserves the history of Arab cinema. Everything here comes from one man's passion for films. Abouti Abu Jaudeh began collecting posters of the Arab world's most important films when he was 15. Today, he has 20,000 vintage film posters and photographs of actors, and he's making his collection available to movie makers and other film buffs. This collection got bigger and bigger over time, and I wanted to archive it so others would be able to use it. Ten years ago, I started organizing all the movies that have been filmed in Lebanon or in the Arab world for people such as cinema students or anyone else who was interested in this type of archive. Hand-painted posters used to be the only way to bring in people to see a film. For my generation, we used to go to the cinema and the first attraction for us was the poster hanging by the entrance. In my memory, the poster is the film, its history and story. Artists advertise Arab productions, ranging from romances to action films and spy thrillers. Arab cinema portrays the situation of people in that period by picturing and documenting it so you can get a feeling of what the people wanted because it expresses the community. The Lebanese Ministry of Culture itself holds only an incomplete archive of the films produced in Lebanon. But Abu Jaude is keeping track. He's making it his responsibility to preserve the golden age of Arab cinema because it might not come again. Abir Ahmar to RT World, Beirut.